Hey folks, got a couple of new acquisitions from the uh, holidays. This is the Freewing F35. Uh, it does have uh, uh, retracts on it. And it also has the thrust vectoring. So wasn't real sure how to set up the thrust vectoring on it. So I think I've got it going for uh, at least to get it on a maiden flight. Um, and, and we'll we'll give it a try in the morning. Uh, the weather's supposed to be halfway decent in the morning, so I'm going to go try to fly it. Uh, this one, and I, uh, I've got the uh, little Stinger 64 millimeter up there. Uh, that is also uh, the other new acquisition. That runs on a four cell 2200. And I did set that up with a. Uh, uh, six channel receiver so I've got it set up with uh, flap rods on that so be interesting I did put the landing gear on it as well it's just fixed landing gear this one here does have the retracts on it and uh, uh, kind of looking forward to this one never I've never flown one with a thrust uh, vectoring uh, system on it before uh, this one does not have a, a rudder it's strictly the uh, uh, movable uh, exhaust port that's going to give it to it, y'all. Uh, the Stinger, it does have a rudder, so looking forward to flying it. So just wanted to give a quick uh, look at them on the bench, and then uh, we'll put this together with the flight uh, uh, maiden flights for tomorrow. All right, back out at the field with Jim. We're out here freezing our radios off, and got the F-35 from Freewing. Maiden flight on it. Does have the thrust thrust vectoring on it. It's dialed in with the uh, elevator and there's your, it doesn't have rudder so that's your only yaw you're going to get. And I did set the uh, elevator one where I can turn it off so for landings and takeoffs. So here we go. Sounds good. Clear my glasses off here. All right, Jim. F-35 from Freewing. Full throttle. Yanking back. Ooh, you're doing good. Ooh. It's really sensitive. Very sensitive on the pitch. Ooh, <laughs> that was sketchy as all get out. Well, I think I'm going to leave the gear down and see if I can bring this home. Something ain't right on it. Probably too high on this approach. I have to go around one more time. Slow it down a little bit. The ailerons are great, but that elevator is completely pinch, pitch sensitive. Too bad you can't dial in some expo while you're in the air. All right, we have the thrust vectoring turned off for the uh, elevator. Good. Wow. That was uh, definitely a piece poor landing, but I'm proud to get it back in one piece, Jim. Uh, that thing is uh, way pitch sensitive. I think it's because the entire elevators move. See that? You got such a huge control. Uh, no, I turned the thrust vectoring off for landing. But the control surfaces are so huge, just a small amount is all you're going to need. 
So I'm going to have to dial this in for some uh, expo. I know I had some in there. Oops. Let's see where we're at. Aileron elevator. Yeah, heck, I've got 65% expo in there already. Alright, back to the drawing board. I'm going to have to do some research on this and try to figure out why is that so pitch sensitive. Um, oh, you know what? There's the problem right there. I'm flipping back and forth between the rate modes. There's high rate, mid rate, and there's off on the thrust vectoring. But notice the elevators are not moving on the so the elevators were on high rates the entire time and it's just too much for it. I need to dial it down to where it's okay. low rates is like this right here. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, I'm done. Alright guys, thanks for watching.